Welcome back, Legendary Potato here, and today I got a new Universal Minecraft Editor video for you guys today because a new update came out, there's some new features, I'm going to go over exactly what you guys can expect and as well as what has been added, and let's get right into it. So anyways, as you can see, here's the, the new 1.1.6, and so if we go ahead and just locate a world, I'll use the rocket ship mod as our example, so I will go ahead and locate that right there. And so, pretty much most of the things are the same, however, there's now a new diamond mod. So that's right, this icon now has a purpose. So if we click on this icon right here, as you can see, it now has specialty mods and as well as the search thing. So we can go ahead and click on the search, which is the first specialty mod. And as you can see, there's pretty much a ton of stuff going on. So there's like the, uh, you can pretty much search for things here. So if you go ahead and click down on these, there's things like MBT tags, entities, tile entities, and blocks. So you can search for all four of these, whichever one you want to specify. You can select the dimension that you want, easy as that. And you can just locate, as you can see, like all the tags are here. If you go to each of these, they each have their own kind of thing. So you can type in the entity ID, tile entity, just type it in. Uh, and the blocks, it gives you the ID, as well as you can turn on the damage value, which is pretty cool. So if you wanted to use that as well, uh, then you could do that and locate certain blocks in your world. So I think it's a really cool, you know, search function. You can just easily put something in, find it and locate it. And I think it's just kind of nice in that way. So let's say I wanted to find something uh, like a minecart, for example. Let's say I wanted to locate a certain minecart in the world. I would just do that and don't press enter, otherwise it closes it. So I'll press search and as you can see, there's six minecarts right here. So one, two, three, four, five, six. As you can see, six occurrences of it, uh, which is pretty cool and just, just kind of gives you like the chunks and uh, everything like that. Organizes everything nicely for you, which is pretty cool as well. Uh, so you can go ahead, find other things, whatever you like. So let's say I wanted to find like another entity. I can just type that in, press search, and I'll see what I get. So as well as that, I can just like do this. If I wanted to find something like, uh, let's say I want to find stone or something like that, I can just type in one, press search, and as you can see, it gives me you know places where the stone is, and I can just go ahead, click on it, and it'll pretty much just kind of bring up the chunk uh, where it is. As you can see right here, it just kind of gives it to me, which is pretty cool. So if I wanted to, you know, locate a chunk really quickly, or if I wanted to mark a chunk somewhere, so then I could like search later with that block ID, then I could quickly find a chunk uh, where that block is and use it there, which actually could be really cool. So you can mark out your worlds uh, with that sort of thing as well. So if you want to have a few chunks in mind where you just search a certain block that you don't use, you can search that, then you can just pretty much find it that way, which I think would be a cool use for it as well. But yeah, so that's pretty much what this is, the search uh, diamond tool mod, which is pretty cool. So you can, as you can see, just cool specialty mod that you can use there. Uh, so it is the first one, it's the only one right now. However, there's probably going to be ones added in the near future as well, which will be really cool, such as GRF editing, uh, which I've been asked a lot about recently. So that will be coming in the near future. I'll be sure to do tutorials on all that sort of stuff when it comes out. But there's also some bug fixes and you know support and stuff like that for all that sort of stuff. So this was kind of the biggest feature in this update, uh, but the rest are bug fixes. So if you guys do want to see the change log, I'll be putting it on the screen right now. So if you want to read all of those changes and fixes and all that sort of stuff, then you can go ahead and read it right there. But anyways, guys, hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. If you did enjoy it, make sure you do leave a like on it and subscribe if you're new to the channel because I do videos like these every single day. If you want to see the next one, then be sure you do subscribe. But anyways, if you haven't gotten the program yet, it is down below in the description if you want to go download it for yourself. I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a good one and peace out.